I'm really good there working with Sonal Stag. Sonal Stag works for different denim jeans brands around the world as consultants and has a store in London. We're going to show you how to look after your jeans and get the best from them. I'm going to show you how to make holes in jeans. It's something, um, obviously, uh, may have different reasons why you want to make holes in jeans, but I would imagine that you want to make them look like old vintage jeans that have got rips in it or so on, just to, to, to express a difference of some sort. So randomly get um, any tools that you have around the house. Um, it can be an old pair of scissors, it can be uh, a, nail, a file um, for nails, it can be sandpaper can be anything because even with sandpaper you can actually make a hole it's probably better with, uh, with some abrasive sandpaper because you can keep doing it in the same area and you'll make a hole which would be a little bit more natural looking otherwise just get any tool that make a stabbing into the jean be careful obviously not to hurt yourself and be very careful how you um, look after the fabric and your hands but literally just make a hole um, any size um, when you wash it, this will fray and it will actually loosen up the fibers uh, and it will make it look more organic and so on. Normally you want a pair, of, um, sometimes people want to make a hole so they actually want to um, perhaps sew around the hole. Um, you don't necessarily need to cut away the fabric but if you want to, you can. Um, and it's very simple, you just make um, some small cuttings. You, I would do smaller cuttings and I need initially to make sure the results right and then you can do a little bit more as, as you grow. Um, always use an old pair of jeans that you want to play with first to make sure that you're happy with the technique and what you're doing and the results are right before going into a fresh pair. Um, but that's how you make holes in jeans.